When the track was first being designed in late 1908, early 1909, the original plans were that it would include a road course. Uh, at one point, they were trying to get a three-mile track onto the property, a three-mile rectangular-shaped oval, and then a road course that would link uh, to it and then go down through the infield. And basically, you'd come out of turn two, and then instead of heading on down the back stretch, you would make a left-hand turn, and then you would veer through the infield and then come back onto the back stretch, just a little bit north of, uh, of where you'd left it. Uh, when they realized that three miles wouldn't fit comfortably, uh, they pulled the track down to make two and a half miles, and so the road course portion was extended to two and a half miles so that uh, you would still have the five mile full course if you decided to use it. So in other words, you could either use just the two and a half mile oval, or you could do the, the, the detour, and uh, when you came by the end of the, uh, the first lap, it would have been five miles. Uh, as it was, the, there were so many difficulties in uh, building the oval track uh, that the road course was never built. And it was 2000 before we had a road course.